going on, y'all? Today, the fit is getting new kicks. Gonna drive up to Brampton, pick up the tires, put them on the new Koenigs. Might link up with Lawrence real quick. Then I gotta go help my dad with some shit. And after that, I gotta go help one of my buddies move. But first, we go get shoes. So I see you there. the place now pick up the tires I don't really know where we are somewhere in Brampton but yeah they got to me super quick let me pick it up instead of waiting like I think it was like gonna be like a week or two weeks to have it delivered to my house and then back here I got the new wheels the decagram go open them up later try to mount and balance everything today so that we can get rid of these winters Amped. A few minutes later. So they're having no problems finding the tires. Hopefully they find them. I'm not trying to come all the way back out to Brampton. A little longer than a few minutes later. Alright, so we didn't end up getting tires. <laughs> there was like a miscommunication between the place I ordered from and then the warehouse. Pretty much he told me that I could pick them up even though they don't allow retail pickups. So it's not a big deal. They're just going to ship them out to me. Tomorrow, they said, or today. They're gonna try to get them shipped out today. So should be here in like a day or two at the crib. Uh, so that was kind of annoying because I drove all the way out here. The good news is gas out here is super cheap. I think it's like 123 in the city right now. So I'm not mad at that. So I'm just gonna fill up out here because I've been meaning to fill up. And yeah, head on with the rest of the day. 24 hours later. Alright yo, so we're out in Scarborough. I came to help the boy Griffin install some joints. <laughs> Fuck, I can't remember what they're called. What are they called, yo? Cradle bushing lockout. Cradle bushing lockout. Something. These things. You did this side so far. And it's 2016 Stang. And we gotta do this side next. But yeah, yo. Pretty easy install. It's been like an hour so far. It's only six points. What up? My big guy. Yeah, yo, it's nice out. I wasn't trying to be in the garage, so we're doing this shit right now. And yeah. So I got work later today, but before I go to work, I just came up to my mom's house to pick up the tires that finally came in. So I just gotta go drop them off with my buddy to get them mounted and balanced, and then we'll have them ready later. Later. So I pull up to the dealership my boy works at. He's gonna mount and balance the tires for me, and I thought I'd go for a stroll in the parking lot while I was waiting. And I seen a Hellcat, I seen a TRX, but of course, what I really fell in love with is this man's Teggy. Just chilling here. I think he's gonna get it driving this summer. That shit fucking slammed. <laughs> Cousin car is nice too. So I just realized the place that I ordered the wheels from sent me these Welsh snacks. And I probably got these wheels like two months ago. Is it bad that I'm about to eat them? They're hard. Uh -oh. 
So I got my wheels back and they look beefy. God damn. Koenig Hypergrams 15 by 8 with a plus 25 offset. And then some Nitto Neo Gens 205.50. This is gonna look so much better than these stock. I think what, like 16 by 6? With a 185 tire. Just gonna have to get some fender rolling done. And then as soon as the coilover comes in. What? As soon as the coilovers come in, they're gonna get put on. Fuck, I can't wait. So I'm back at home. Uh, I'm super glad I got the whole wheel situation sorted with today. I picked the decagrams, the Koenig decagrams, because they were very cheap for what they are, and they're super light. And I think they just really look good on the on the fit. Uh, as for the tires, the Nitto Neo Gens in the 205 50, uh, I just thought that they're a nice all season tire, especially up here in Canada. Like, I do have winters, but sometimes in fall or in spring you do get a bit of snow, so it's nice to have that option. Thank you all for watching today though. Today was kind of more like a vlogging kind of day, and I don't know if I'm going to be doing this or not, but if you like it, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll keep making videos like this. If you all have any questions about the wheels, tires, anything about the car, drop it in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to go give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and go follow the build on Instagram. That's gonna be it for today, y'all, and I'll see you guys next time.